and I got close to the camera. I said, I'm looking for soup. I'm looking for chicken noodle soup. Fucking obviously. Just left the workout. I also just farted and all the windows are rolled up. Good morning, everybody. Hello, how are we feeling? Hello, hello, hello. I forgot my camera at my house. Um, so I have resorted to using my phone, my only other option. Um, these trees are absolutely giving me exactly what I need right now. It kind of looks like I'm in Beverly Hills. Let's just say I am. On my walk with Coast right now, me and Ayla came to a coffee shop. I'm shirtless, so I did not go into the coffee shop, nor do I want coffee. As of recently, the sun's been coming out and it's been feeling really good. So I feel like just taking my shirt off. I feel like it's summer again. Although LA has had some crazy weather uh, in the very recent past, I think yesterday it was hailing for some people in LA. We're getting new video just into the eyewitness newsroom showing the hail popping up around Southern California. This is hail and thunder in Porter Ranch. For me, it was only raining, but it was raining very hard and it was raining a lot. But today, this is the weather that we got blessed with and uh, I am not happy. Not happy. I am not mad about it. Okay, since we've turned around, we are now walking directly in the sun. Like I said, we we're at a coffee shop. Um, I've walked down the street a little bit just so I can record a little bit for this vlog. As you guys know, I get crippling anxiety when I vlog in front of people and there's a lot of people in front of the coffee shop. So we're on the way back to meet up with Ayla. She's probably already ordered her coffee. She's probably drank half of it. Probably wondering where I am. Probably going to call me at any moment. So we're just going to go back, grab a coffee for her and continue this beautiful walk on this beautiful sunny day. I hope it's a uh, nice weather for you guys, wherever you're watching. If it's not, come to Cali. <laughs> okay. See you later. Okay, once again, forgot my camera at home. Just left the workout. I also just farted and all the windows are rolled up. Jesus Christ, it fucking smells in here. Sorry, that might've been a little bit, a little bit TMI. But I have to be honest, you know, we're we're vlogging and that, that's what happened part of the day. So I can't, you know, I have to tell you guys what happened. Um, Went in, did a workout, hit some legs, hit some chest, hit some shoulders. You guys already saw it. I don't even know why I'm explaining myself or trying to explain what I did in the workout. Drink the full water. Okay, maybe not the full thing. Still got a little bit left, but I am absolutely shattered, mate. I don't even, maybe I'm not saying the right thing. I am fucking tired. Now on my way home, I have to drink a protein shake. I have to eat something or I will not make it another 24 hours. There is a big ass helicopter going over. Today's been a good day so far. Got a walk in, got a workout in, drank my water. I'm feeling good. Now time to go home and eat a lot of food. Woo! Okay, it is the next day. Hello, how we be? Feeling. Today is Tuesday. We love Tuesdays. Tuesdays are one of my favorite days. Speaking of how we are feeling, I have this book called Look Inside, I think. I don't even know if that's what it's called. That's just what it says. I got this book a little bit ago, and the cool thing about this book is each page has something new on it. So for instance, this page says, what will it take for you to feel like you've made it? And then the next page says, a time you've proved yourself wrong. And then the next page says, a list of people who mean a lot to you right now and then so on and so forth. So I'm only on page three and I thought we would do it together. I've completed page one and two. The first page just says, say anything. Second page said, one thing that is your thing. I completed those and I did those a very long time ago. Here we go, we're going to do the next one together. Now you're probably wondering, how the hell are we gonna do this together, Keen? You're the one with the book. Well, you're correct. I'm the one with the book. You guys are the ones with the comment section. So on this page, it says, capture a feeling on this page. Write it down, draw it, take a picture that you'll insert here. Anything that'll help you remember what it felt like when you came back to this page in the future. That's what it says and that's what we're gonna do. Okay, while you guys are writing in the comments, I will be writing in my journal. Okay, I am done and I thought I would share. At first I was thinking I'm gonna keep mine private just because it's in the book and this is like my little book. But since you guys are sharing in the comments, I thought I would share what I wrote down in 
my journal. For my journal entry, I wrote down daily vlogging for 54 days straight was very fun, exciting, exhausting, motivating, and challenging. I want to remind myself that anything is possible and anything you set your mind to can be achieved with hard work and dedication. Remember, every marathon starts with the first step. I just kept mine short, simple, sweet. I don't wanna have to look back on this book and have to read a novel. Also, there are so many pages, so eventually when I look back on this book, I want to be able to read each one pretty quickly and just kind of get a good, good sense of what I was feeling that day. Right, we've made it to the grocery store, my favorite place on earth. I feel like I come to the grocery store maybe once or twice uh, a week. And I think I put the grocery store in every single one of my vlogs. How crazy is that? It's like my second home. This time on our grocery store run, we have a list. And yes, I write down my list on piece of paper because I am ancient and I don't know how to use my phone to write lists. <laughs> Obviously, I'm kidding. I don't know why, I just like my post-it notes. I'm, uh, I'm old school like that, you could say. On the list, we have toilet paper, chocolate milk, ground beef, rainbow berries? Rainbow berries, what is that? I don't know why I wrote rainbow berries, but hopefully when we get in, to the grocery store we can find rainbow berries. We also have Chobani yogurt, perfect bars, which are basically just like granola bars slash protein bars. Very good. We need bananas, baby food, and chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup. Yum. Love chicken noodle soup. And also Ayla requested it. All right, well, let's go, uh, let's go grocery shopping. I'm in the soup aisle and I'm scared that someone's gonna walk down this aisle and my anxiety is gonna shoot through the roof. So far there's no one here, so I'm feeling okay. I'm looking for chicken noodle soup. What the heck I filmed in there. I just tried I tried to get as much footage as I can in there. I hate going into places and bringing out my camera and talking to them. I was in the soup aisle and I got close to the camera and said, I'm looking for soup. I'm looking for chicken noodle soup. Fucking obviously. Obviously I'm looking for soup. I just didn't know what to say. I didn't know what to say. And then someone walked by me. Oh my God. That was a lot. That was a lot. I don't know why I don't get that bad anxiety filming if I'm with people, if I'm with anybody else, I can go into any place and I'm good to film. Like everything that I've done for KJ, it's like it doesn't matter. Once I'm solo, oh, I feel like everyone's looking at me. Speaking of looking at me, two people gave me compliments on my hair. One was right before I ended the last clip. Uh, she said she liked my hair. And then one was just right now. I was walking to my car and another person said they liked my hair. Also someone in Ralph's just stared at me for probably five to six seconds. So Maybe I got three compliments, maybe two and a half. I don't know. I got two for sure. Okay, well, now we go home and probably make some food because I am very hungry. All right, see you at home. Okay, freaking yum. Now that I'm looking at it, it kind of looks like a happy face. But I made my burger. I used a quarter pound of ground beef. I think that's a quarter pound. I might be wrong. Got some Havarti cheese. I also mixed in some cheddar cheese into the burger. And then I made my own sauce, which is mayonnaise, mustard, ketchup, and garlic, which sounds Sounds gross, but that's basically just like Big Mac sauce. Got some lettuce, a ton of it because I absolutely love crunchy lettuce on a burger. And then I sliced up some tomatoes. We don't have any onions, but if we had onions, I would cut them up. <sighs> Must have been a ghost. I don't know who that was. But I'm about to dive in and I'll let you know how it tastes. I'm sure it's just gonna be a 10 out of 10 because I made it. I'm a professional chef now. But uh, yeah, I think it's gonna be good. It looks good. I can't wait to eat it. And you already know I'm gonna be enjoying this burger with a crispy Coke. <sighs> Whoa. Um, all right, well, see ya. I'll let you know how it, how it is in the next clip. Guys, I'm so bad at ending my vlogs. Almost every single one of my vlogs have an ending like this. And that's because when I film throughout the whole day and I get like a bunch of good, funny content, at the end of the day, I feel like I'm done. I'm like, whoa, I'm done. But I'm not. And I never realized that until I start to edit. So this is just another ending to my vlog. Freaking love you guys. I freaking appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Today is Wednesday. That means I'll see you Friday. I love you. Z, hoo, he, hoo, he, hoo, he, hoo. Hurt.